My constituency question is to the Minister for Major Projects, Territories and Local Government. In the Karangamite electorate, there are deep concerns about the lack of infrastructure go, investment to improve Members transport links to and from Melbourne. With V-Line services currently in chaos, there is no plan from the Victorian government to duplicate the rail line through southern Geelong. There is also deep concern about the cancellation of the east-west link, which would have delivered a proper western road link. Has the Andrews government informed the Commonwealth of the commitment to fund and construct the Western Distributor Project? The member's time has expired. The minister has the call. Well, I do thank the member for Karangamite for her question. The member for Karangamite has a lot of issues to cover. She is passionate on behalf of her electorate and she will use every second of parliamentary time available to her in defence of her constituents. There is no issue that she will not take forward on behalf of her constituents, be it the question of V-Line services and the regrettable mismanagement of that matter by the Victorian state government, be it telecommunications, be it infrastructure, be it TV reception. There is no stone the member for Karangamite will leave unturned in seeking to make the case for the members of her electorate, and she has a particularly strong commitment to and interest in infrastructure. And the Turnbull government has committed over $7.8 billion in infrastructure projects in Victoria. We're delivering on projects like the Prince's Highway duplication and the upgrading of the Great Ocean Road, and what a champion the member was on that issue for her constituents. Both of these vital projects for the state of Victoria, vital projects for the electorate of Karangamite. And of course, another critical project for the state of Victoria, recognised by the Abbott government and our commitment continued by the Turnbull government, is the East West Link, to which we committed $3 billion in the 2015 budget. Now, this project was first recommended. This project was first recommended by Rod Eddington in a report in 2006 commissioned by the Brax Labor government. And of course, the Napthine government entered into contracts. What happened when the Andrews government came to power? They ripped up the contracts and $1.1 billion, $1 billion of taxpayers' money was wasted, according to the Victorian Auditor General. Now, the member for Karangamite represents constituents who would be greatly advantaged were the East West Link to proceed. Should a Victorian government come forward and be ready to proceed with the East West Link, then the Turnbull government would stand ready to support that project. Of course, if the Victorian government comes forward with a proposal for the Western Distributor. We will consider that on its merits, but of course what we need to see is a business case, and we stand by our view. We stand by our view. Member for we McEwen. stand by our view that the East West Link would be better. Of course, Member if the Victorian Isaacs. government comes forward with a business plan as to what it proposes to proceed with, we will engage with the Victorian the government in a McMahon constructive fashion.